streaming and I'm still not recording. Why is my recording stop? Like every time my recording just stops for no reason. Oh, I'm starving. I need food. Really good news of food. Excuse, Excuse me. me. Excuse me. You find those raiders? <laughs> yeah, I took care of them. No kidding? That's the best piece of news we've had around here for a good long time. So we've been talking. We decided if you came through for us, we'd join up with the Minivan. If we want things to get better, we've got to start helping each other. Well, no shit, Sherlock. We're in. You can count on us if you need help down the line. Uh -huh. I just I want to trade, trade a few things. things. Sure. I'll buy a ball cap of you for that much. Wow, really? Oh wow, he was just giving me stuff. Okay, cool. <laughs> the ghouls are freaking disturbing, like from hills out eyes stuff. So yeah. If your brain rots away, but yet your heart and all your other organs still work, would that still consider being alive or dead? You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. Not much use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. So, there's something I need to ask you. Yes, you know I'm one of the last of the Minutemen. But I never really told you what happened to us. Finally, I'm listening. Have you heard of the Quincy Massacre? What was it? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. Where the Minutemen betrayed each other and the people they were supposed to protect. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turn their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. That's Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead, so I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord? As long as you don't give up, the Minutemen will survive. I'm not about to give up, but I can't protect the Commonwealth all by myself. Hell, I could barely protect these people. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild them in a minute, but I think you can. Why can't you lead the minute man? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds, but that's not gonna be enough to bring the minute man back from the brink. 
We need someone who can bring the whole so pretty much in this series of Fallout, you're bringing a whole army. I think you've got it in you to be that leader. Well, what makes you think I can do this? You saved us in Conquer. There wasn't anything in it for you. You had your own problems to deal with, but you did it anyway. That kind of selflessness has been a mighty short supply around here for quite a while. Okay, I'll do it. Good. Hey, kill you and take your Good. gun. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new start for the Miniman and the Commonwealth too. Don't worry, I'll be right beside you all the way, General. That's quite a promotion you just gave me. The leader of the Miniman has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in '82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last Miniman is. There's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new general. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. I've gotten word about a settlement that's being threatened by raiders. Mm -hmm. I'll mark it on your map. We'll find out what they need. Okay, let's rest a second. Is there something you need? How are you feeling? I'm glad to have the chance to return the favor. Anything else? Come with me. I need your help. Sure thing, General. Is there something you need? No. Nothing. All right. Heads up. Cool. We can have dog meat and an I'll follow This place is starting to feel like home. Now that we can grow, the trouble is, the more we establish ourselves here, the more of a target. We become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be able to relax a little bit. What sort of defenses did you have in mind? Walls, sandbags, turrets, whatever you can put together. This is going to be interesting. Hopefully I know what to use. Better keep our eyes peeled. Sorry guys, I'm not talking a lot. It's uh yeah, well my mind. Just thinking. But if you guys are liking, please stay tuned. Just keep watching. Tell me what you guys think. I'm really into this game. I'm so sorry that I'm not speaking so much. This game's 
actually a lot of fun that I could build my own settlement and stuff. I'm definitely gonna start building over there. Sturgis, thanks for doing that. We'll all sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road, but yeah, I think this is it. Oh, feels good. What next? Well, I guess figuring out how to get back to living instead of just surviving. Of course, you know you're welcome anytime. My door is always open to you. Well, this is my home, you bitch. Some of the walls actually come to think of it. I guess I better get back to it. Take care now. Codsworth. Sir, welcome back, sir. I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Concord. You could say that. I made a few new friends. I have enough of those these days. I realized that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but if needed, I'd be honored to accompany. Would you like to? As you wish, sir. I'd like to trade some items. Of course. How do I get, how do I upgrade these? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Let's check out the power. Spanius. Needs more copper, so. Where can I get copper? This is gonna be a shack. <laughs> is it?
was a corner. Yeah, I'm just building a house. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just kind of interested in how this looks. Okay, so that makes sense. Okay. Ah, cause I'm using the wrong walls, my dumbass.
shit, no, it's not me. Shanty, but it's a place that you call home, you know. You have somewhere to rest your head and be happy at, man. It's home. Much, but it's a house. This is like so Minecraft type shit, but it's just a lot easier. Seriously. Three stories. That seems interesting. Yep, yeah, you, you can. Seems like you can. Son of a bitch, you can't make it through stories. Awesome. Three story house. Ain't much, but it's my house. Complete with everything but a door. Trees, see? Trees. I'm not gonna clear out most of these things because there's a lot of fucking trees in the way.
cool. Structures, wood, furniture, beds. I can't make a bed for my own house. Let's get this game started again because I've just been digging around on there just doing nothing. Now what I gotta do? Jewel of the Commonwealth. Lin Man mission. Alright, so I gotta go help the people there too. Alright, so I'm gonna help these people out then. They need some stuff. So why not? Give them some defenses, give them some... What's it? What's, uh... What's it? Oh my god. Hmm. All day stream is still going. Yeah, no one's, uh... No one new still on. Sorry I'm not talkative, I've been really Look apologizing alive. for that. Okay. I really don't want you guys being upset about that. I've been, you know, trying. But I just, this gun's, this game's a lot of fun. I'm just, whew. this game's just enveloping me into this game. This is, oh my god, I can't even just talk. Keep that. Does anyone? I don't think he's can this to go. Well, see, he's still got food. Let's get rid of some trees. Build up their defenses. You hear the news from Labernathy Farm? Their eldest daughter is going down by. Help 
of them out. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna take a break. I am going to go get some meat because I am very, very hungry. So I'll cut the stream off here for now. Check you guys back later. <laughs>